Hey y'all. Uh, I finally got some stuff done um, this week. It's been uh, mostly orders, so I have something to show for this week. Usually I do this on Monday or Tuesday, but I've got to get this stuff to the shop or shipped out. So um, I figured I'd go ahead and show y'all what I've got going on now, because by Monday I won't have it here. So I hope everybody's staying cool. I know it's hotter than two rats screwing in a wool sock out there. And uh, thankfully here in Texas, we've had about four or five, well, about four days of rain, about six plus inches. Uh, the creek river thing running by my house, behind the house, is really full. Uh, we went out there tubing. <laughs> I know. We went out there tubing the other day, and it was really good. It was it was fun. Uh, we just got to figure out how to get a sea dew to get a sea dew because if we got a sea dew out there, pull us around. You're all thinking, this thing ain't big enough for Cedar. It is. You can put a small boat out there. You know, I'm thinking about putting a party barge out there. And, uh, but no, my luck and everybody else, we all get drunk and drowned. So, I better not do that. Alright, let's get to this. Uh, this one's a little order from one of my favorite clients. I just love her to death. And then she just had a family member that just had a baby. So, I was plum tickled when I got to do an order for her. This is a little newborn dress done in real soft yellow and real soft. I mean, just, oh, just yummy. I need to put a little button on the back for the closure, but I haven't figured out what I'm going to do. I got a little duck button that I think would look really cute. But the duck is like on an orangey side. And I don't know if that would ruin it or... I'm on the fence because I'm not good with this. Mr. Man always picks out the colors, the decorations and stuff like that. Well, he's all back on the road. So I'm having to defend for myself. And I'm not doing so good, guys. Alright. This one is for um, the Aspermont, Texas Hornets school colors. Uh, they're red and black and I have a lady that wanted a little poncho for her daughter to go to school in and this one's red and black and it's got the ruffle bottom I mean the little kind of ruffle bottom I can do most school colors um, my yarn suppliers kinda getting going back in their stores but it's still painfully slow so the, but see now they come out with teen color yarn where it's a mix of colors like they have a red and black mix come out but I haven't been able to get it so that's how I had to do that but uh, they have it's a mix the variegated mix and you can get it in like orange um, purple and gold red and black green and white I mean on and on and on you can get those so uh, if you're looking for a certain way a color scheme let me know I can take care of you either doing it that way or trying to get the mix it's just going to be kind of whatever alright the last thing I've got going on right here is if you're following the crochet crowd they're doing a thing called the top down shawl and um, it's just a shawl that you just go from the top down and uh, I chose, I don't know, I know this, the yarn I got used for this is Deborah Norval. I don't think I did that right. But anyway, and it's really soft. It's just really yum. Another one. You know, I'm, I'm having a lot of yummy yarn to this week. So, um, just, oh, I love it. Uh, so anyway, here's what I've got for the top down shawl. Like I said, it's really big, so it's not going to fit in the camera. And this one is not an order. This is one just to do it because that was the pattern of the week or whatever. And I thought, well, why not? So that one is for sale. It is on my page at Sunny Crochet. I'm going to put the link in the description box down there somewhere. Because um, y'all are asking, well, where am I finding this page? And I keep forgetting to put the link down there. So, you know, that's kind of my bad. Um, but anyway, y'all, that's what I've got. Orders, okay, I know I put it on my on my uh, 
page, but I'm gonna say it here too. If you're wanting something for Christmas, I need y'all to get those orders in by November the first. That way, I have plenty of time to get it worked up, get it mailed off, and have plenty of time. Okay. Um, so I need y'all to have those in by November the first because uh, last year it got a little hectic. I was doing orders at November, almost the end of November. And um, if that's going to be the case, if y'all are, if you need anything past say November the twelfth, there's going to be an extra five dollar fee to it. I know that's not a whole lot, and there may be some to, that's a whole lot, but I've got to have time to do this. I refuse to just, you know, hurry up a project and make it look like crap. I want to be able to spend the time, the love that it needs. Um, to make sure you get the right product, get the right th everything that you want, and uh, I don't want to be rushed to do that because Christmas, these things are going to people that you know you care about and uh, are personal, and I just I just don't like to be rushed on that because during the week like these ones I have plenty of time, you know I can make my work look good and and make it look like I want to make it look. And uh, I don't want to have to come down the last minute and somebody will like, hey, I need a whole full-blown blanket and it's two weeks till Christmas. That ain't going to fly, y'all. So we got to be a little more organized this year. And I'm saying the deadline's going to be November the 1st. Unless you contact me before, if you're having a problem to get me in November the 1st, I need you to contact me ASAP and be like, hey, I need to make an order. And um, but the way my pay schedule goes, I can't pay or do it to like November the tenth or whatever. Just let me know. I need to be no told. You know, we're not going to have a chaotic gear this year. We are going to be organized about this. <laughs> we can hope. So you know, that's all I ask is we try to get those in. And I know it's still a little early to think about Christmas, but it is almost the middle of July. And uh, I want to be able to have time to get stuff in because, um, you know, it may be something simple as a hat or something, but then I may also have something that's very complicated, a blanket. You know, I want to make sure I get everybody in. Um, and I will let you know what your number is in line when you decide. Right now, I'm caught up on orders. I'm fully caught up. So if you want to go ahead and get it in, that's fine. I take PayPal. And uh, you can go ahead and get it in. You need to. You have to pay before I will start working on your project. I'm tired of getting burned, so you have to pay up front um, your pro for your project. Now, if it's a blanket and I'm not sure how much we're gonna be in, then I'll say, hey, okay, let's do a deposit of this. That's non-refundable. Get stuck. Get started on your project. And once I finish it, be like, hey, okay, the rest of it's going to be such and such. I'll give you a ballpark so you kind of know, so you aren't going to be like, oh my gosh. But y'all know me. My prices are so dang cheap. I barely make anything, but that's okay. I don't care. Whatever. So anyway, y'all, take care. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Please like. And uh, please share. Thank y'all.